Today we're going to be taking a look at the T1 vehicle wiring harness with the four pull flat trailer connector. This product fits certain years of the Ford Transit Connect. To see if this is a fit for your vehicle or to double check if it's a fit for your vehicle, you can use the vehicle fit guide located at eTrailer.com. It's going to provide a four way flat trailer connector at the back of your vehicle to power your trailer signal lights. This is compatible with 5 pole, 6 pole, and 7 pole adapters. Adapters are sold separately. And it comes with a dust cap for the four way flat connector. That way you can cover up the connection points when the plug's not being used. The black box, this is your taillight converter. This is the included modulite that's going to ensure that your vehicle's wiring matches that of your trailers. The powered module is going to connect directly to the vehicle battery through the wiring to avoid overloading the vehicle's electrical system. Now this is designed to connect quickly and easily. All you need to do is locate the connection points behind the taillights and plug in your connectors. The connector with the yellow and brown wiring, that's going to go to the driver's side of the vehicle. Connector with the green and red wiring is going to go to the passenger side. The connectors on this harness are going to match up perfectly with the ports on the vehicle and they're going to snap lock together for a nice tight secure fit. Once you have those plugged in you'll need to make a ground connection. That's going to be your white wire that has a ring terminal already attached to it. You want to get that grounded to a nice clean metal surface with the included grounding screw. And then you'll need to mount your converter box and you can do that with the double sided adhesive foam tape that's provided with the kit. Once you have all that done, you'll need to run the hot lead to the vehicle battery. The hot lead is going to be the short black wire coming out of the converter box. This is going to get connected to the bundle of black wire with one of the included butt connectors. The other end of the bundle runs to the vehicle battery gets another butt connector attached to it and connects to one half of your fuse holder. The other half of the fuse holder gets a ring terminal attached to it and connects to the positive post of the vehicle battery. It's going to come with your 15 amp fuse, goes directly in the fuse holder and then it's got the fuse cap that goes over to keep it safe and protected. Once your installation is complete, the four-way connector is going to be stowed in an out-of-the-way location within your cargo area. Um, I also want to mention that the kit's going to come with some zip ties or cable ties. Those can be used to secure any excess or slack in the wiring that you may have. It's also recommended that you use a small amount of dielectric grease on all your electrical connections. Like the plugs on the vehicle and the four pole connector itself, the grease is designed to help prevent corrosion to the connection points. It is sold separately and available at eachother.com if you're in need. When it comes to the maximum amperage for the stop and turn lights, we're looking at 4.2 amps per circuit. For the taillights, we're looking at 7.5 amps per circuit. And this unit does come with detailed installation instructions to help walk you through the entire process step by step. That's going to do it for today's look at the T1 vehicle wiring harness with the four pole flat trailer connector. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.